The brain is an incredibly sophisticated time, um, timing device and temporal processing device. And I'll give you two examples of that. Um, so in language, for example, if I say two sentences like, um, they gave her cat food or they gave her cat food. So there's two different meanings there and based on pause. Um, and another example is in music. And music, of course, doesn't make sense. Um, I think music would be less enjoyable in an internalist universe, right? <laughs> because it's already out there. Um, it's sort of the change. And so um, I give an example. Um, and I think um, now might be a good time if we can play the audio clip. And this audio clip will be of a song. And the challenge to you is to see if you can recognize the song. If it reminds you of anything, I'll explain what it is um, later. I'll give you guys a clue, and a clue that um, whenever I give this to my undergrads, they look at me with a blank face. But the, the name of the group is the Beatles. <laughs> and, um, <clears throat> and so this, see if this song reminds you of anything. So can we play that, please? So does that remind you guys of any one or two songs? Does any, anything pop into he your heads? Yell Submarine, anything? Very good. Anything else? My Girl. What? Any other Beatles songs? <laughs> so somebody said yesterday. So the people who sort of picked up on um, Yell Submarine were paying attention to the notes. Um, but the timing was totally of yesterday. So it was a hybrid song in which we, we sort of crossed both of the songs, one the spatial and temporal. And I think this is a nice example, first place, well, of how important um, time is to everything we do. And how, um, and again, this is the idea that time is really um, flowing. Um, but at the same time, how sophisticated the brain's ability is to tell time on the scale of, of tens of um, hundreds of milliseconds to a few seconds. And, <laughs> If you slow music down or speed music up too much, or if you slow speech down or spe slow speech up um, or speed speech up too much, it ceases to be um, speech or music. So there's this very, very um, critical um, range or the Goldilocks zone of timing. 